Alright guys, so I think in the process of doing this, I might have attracted an entire hordes uh, to my home base, but that won't be a problem. I mean, with two watchtowers, what should I fear anyways? <laughs> Okay, so I need to talk to Tara. So I do believe she's upstairs. Now that's Hopper here. Actually, let me see. I think I'm not boosting. Um, yeah, I'm definitely not doing it. And we can also upgrade this for two more outposts. Uh, Tara, where are you? Or oh, she's actually here. Oh, look at this. This actually provides really good vantage point on top of this one. <laughs> Great, excellent. I count at least 10 bodies near that plague zone. Fresh kills. Must be a lot of survivors nearby. Come back safe. Are you kidding me? I. Are, are you kidding me? Do you want Brandon to die? Already suffering from the blood plague? Actually, let me see by how. What's the percentage there? Later. Ah, oh, no, that's not a problem then. Keep recovering, mate. Okay, so I need to get there, and then I have a trader, and I have a survivor. Okay, I see where this guy is. Alright, let's see how long this thing is going to take, because I don't think I have that patience. Three minutes, probably too much. I want to upgrade this. I guess so. You know the drill, we're gonna be on our way and hopefully we can get things done without dying. Oh shit, I think we have way too many Zeds now. Hopefully we don't have any freak. Oh no, you won't catch me. Alright, that's how you get rid of them. Oh, I think I'm gonna like this. And I think I'm definitely at the wrong location. I think they were in here, but they're actually in the next building. But that's not a problem. Nice. Because this will mean that I can loot in here before I do something else. And you know how much I love looting. <laughs> I guess so tell me what are your impression of um I mean of the mods so far because I do believe they actually they actually pretty good uh, the mod list is really well it's really well done and I really I really enjoy for the first time having um this plague this plague freaks actually make everything a lot more interesting definitely because I think on nightmare zone to be honest I was just cruising most of the time I wasn't even worried about being stealthy yeah so I do believe that definitely this uh, this mods definitely changed the way I see the game and the way I play it now. Because you can see, I thought I was getting, I think I was getting a, a way too, uh, how do you call it, way too comfortable. And definitely, this game is teaching me again. Yeah, you can never be too comfortable here. All right, and I miss what I just received, but that's not a problem. Oh boy, they're getting attacked there. That's a lot of stuff. Well, actually, I think I can sell them uh, the salvage furnace, to be honest, because I never use it anyways. I do not see the purpose of, I mean, for at least for me, using it. I've never seen the... Uh, yeah, I've never seen how useful it was for me. Hi there. So I really don't need it. Uh, you can get this, this, and this. But definitely, I'm gonna have to take this uh, this ammo press. No, but I don't need to. I have the warlord. <laughs> okay, so I need to make textbooks, but I don't know how to make them, unfortunately. But I'll grab I'll grab all the rucksacks that I can. I'm also gonna take this and this. Hopefully, I still have enough influence. 1948. That's still more than enough.
Wait, I do believe I had a repair kit somewhere, yes. Alright, let's drop this and this. It's quite heavy. Like, I don't want any unnecessary fights. Alright, there we go. Uh, so, Rojo, I'm gonna grab one of these again and then I'm done with her. Now I can continue to my quest. I feel like I'll have a lot more, I mean, all the ammo that I need. So it's still further down the road. Shouldn't be too far normally. Oh shit. It's this guy right next to it, right next to a plague heart. Unbelievable. Oh boy. All right. I really wanted to secure that outpost, but eventually, first thing first, the mission. Oh yeah, this place could come in real handy as an outpost. Yeah, but I don't want to establish this one. Alright, some ammo. I mean, not ammo, some medicine uh, right here. That was actually very unexpected. Alright, so let's see what they have on them. They probably have a note indicating what happened. Okay, so a map to a location with the word rendezvous scrib scribbled has to be under the destination. Alright, so we need to go and check it out. Okay, it's two of them. They're not paying attention, he attention here, so let's be smart. That's a whole lot of nothing we got here. Better keep my eyes open. God damn it, this one's gonna attract everyone. Man, shut the fuck up. Okay, the work's done and this outpost is ready for use. Alright, so still I need oh I need to be careful. Right, nice and easy. Okay, so what I'm gonna do... Shit, there are way too many Zeds in this area. So I need to travel all the way down there. Then this is gonna be a very long recording, guys. I think it's, it's gonna be over an hour, so definitely it's gonna be a lot of episodes. We'll find out. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna have to take the risk. There's no doubt about it. I'm gonna be prepared. If I need to shoot that 50 cal, then I'll shoot it for sure. Damn, that's <laughs> Whoa, okay, there are two of them. Uh, two of them. Uh, who the hell are you? The man telling you have to leave town or die. Later. Okay, people skills and this guy has, I don't know, I'm gonna go with the safer option because at the moment this is not really safe, including that we have a plague heart next to us and I have a 50 car, so this is not gonna work. So I run this time, you can stay as long as you join us. Cool right? Oh, I was ready to 
I was ready to bail, literally. <laughs> uh, I don't want to recruit you. And she has what? People's skills. What am I supposed to do with that? Anyways. So, I'm sorry, but damn, where am I even? Yeah, electrical, political science. Oh, cooking. Wait, first thing, before we go anywhere else. Cuisine. Alright, so it's good like that, so... I don't care. I refuse. Guess I'll see you around. Yeah, that's right. Get the hell out of here. And then Tiffany. Um, I don't need another person that already has skills. I mean, a fifth skill, so... Also, hit the road. Alright, see? We don't need violence to resolve a, I mean every conflict. That's a lot of stuff. Alright. So that now this is done. I'm thinking of just ending the uh end, in all directions. Better be careful. Of ending the, 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 the recording here because I feel like it's gonna be too long and I don't wanna have too many pre-recorded episodes. So as soon as I'm done looting in this area, definitely it's gonna mark the end of the the episode. I don't care if I still have if I still have an active quest. Yeah, guys, sorry about that. I really thought I had the feral. You know how I feel about ferals in this game. I don't know whether I should establish a temporary outpost in here. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Alright, so you know the drill. It's gonna be a temporary outpost. The outpost is up and, running. and also, this will give me the advantage eventually to rest this guy and then use someone that... Yeah, someone useful. <laughs> it's not gonna be Brandon for sure, No, Martin. Wait, actually, I've never played with Martin. All right, so let's make him uh, quite strong. Let's see, what weapon can he carry? Probably, no, not a professional break for sure. All right, I think, I believe this should be fine for him. Down to the last magazine here. All right. Guys, so as you can see, I'm bringing quite a lot of resources uh, to my home base. So eventually, this outpost is going to be ditched at a certain point. Uh, maybe in a few minutes from now. Oh, I hope so. Alright, so now I'm flirting slightly with danger by doing the, the fast search. But I really don't have time to waste at the moment. I mean, when I started recording this, eventually I didn't plan it to be this long. But you know how games are. You just start and then <laughs> you get sucked in. Oh, hell yeah. I guess so. I do believe that I'm going to do my final quest. Unfortunately, I really want to see what this guy is right saying, there. so I'm going to go back qu quickly to my home base, quickly deliver all the goods, and then I'm going to do the quest. That's a sure thing. So I'll see you guys in a few seconds. Alright guys, there we go. Finally back at the home base. I had another quest that popped. Oh, it's the, uh, the Bruce. But I'm not going to do it now, eventually. I'm gonna save it for for later. I just want to do this final quest of the survivor in need before I wrap up with this recording. I don't even know how many episodes I'm gonna make out of this, but you know what? We gotta take that risk. Shit! What did I just do? All 
Right, I do believe that I have enough resources. Let's see. I actually wanted to take uh, the suppressor out of this. There we go. Okay, so it's right up there, so it's not too far. D can I travel on foot? I, d I don't really want to. Uh, that's a sure thing. So let's see. Martin can give us plus 10 foot storage. That's actually a good boon as well. But anyway, let's focus quickly on the quest before I finish this recording. Let's do this. Alright, so I can't remember what this guy wanted from us. Let's see, there's no plague heart here, that's a good thing already. Come on, there's a Zed that followed me all the way here. Unbelievable. That's actually pretty courageous. Like, really? You follow me all the way here? Come on. Okay, so hopefully this guy won't tell me that he needs to take a faction out because I'm not about that life. I've been trying to find my son since we got separated escaping a refugee camp. Okay, so it's one of those quests. I still accepted it regardless. Maybe I'm just stupid, right? Maybe I am. <laughs> I don't know. All right, okay, we need to bail. We need to get the hell out of here. I just spotted a plague zone. All right, follow the vehicle. Come on. Alright guys, so for this quest, unfortunately, um, 27 rounds won't be enough, so I need a lot more than that. Uh, let's see, we can drop this and this, I won't need it. Any weapon with 762 here will actually do me some good. There we go. Alright, hopefully I don't lose this as well. So let's quickly analyze. So this is the lost location. And then we also have hostile here, the diamond bags. Okay, so I see where this spot is. We're gonna go at night, unfortunately. All right, guys, so this is probably uh, that time where my character is probably gonna pass. Just hang in there. Oh shit. Okay, so there's one of them who doesn't have a weapon. But I can't see a thing, unfortunately, because it's night time. Stay 
Okay, they're not attacking me, guys. Is it just me? I feel so confused. How it goes? Got anything useful you're looking to unload? Okay, sure. I guess so. I really thought they, these people were gonna be hostile towards me. Hopefully, I won't get headshotted in here. You know how these bugs work. Oh shit, I didn't want to do that. Sorry, York. God, not another one. <laughs> I'm so, I'm really sorry, York. I didn't want to this do that. Isn't fair. That's too bad. Man, I didn't mean to do that. I'm really sorry. That was really messed up. Be seeing ya. Yeah, I, I did. The, God damn it! I don't know why, but it happened. It's unfortunately something that I didn't want to do. Okay, move it along. But uh, yeah, so this is going to mark the end of the recording. I don't know how many episodes we are getting from this, probably 10. <laughs> okay, now that is just me exaggerating as usual. But I just want to say, guys, thank you so much okay. for sticking um, to the channel. Thank you so much for the support, the comments. I really enjoy all that. And with that being said, guys, I love you all. And I'll see you in the next part then. Cheers.